24 hour fasting day. So get ready, get your bone broth, and let's go. Good morning, good morning. Welcome all you new folks and welcome back everybody to Loving It on Keto. I have a hair appointment, hooray, hooray. I need the ends trimmed, I need my roots done, I just need my hair done. So I took a shower, just blow dried my hair. Don't put any treatment or any product on it because it has to be clean for Zana to work her magic. Yes, indeed. But you guys, today is, let me move Harry's information is Saturday. It's a 24 hour fast using bone broth throughout the day to squelch hunger. You can drink black coffee, black tea, sparkling water, regular water throughout the day. No added sweeteners today, you guys. So let me put Harry's paperwork back. No, this is my paperwork, sorry. We had a whole day of doctors yesterday. Went to the doctor of internal medicine to talk to the doctor about Harry's colitis and it's got his high blood pressure medicine uh, fixed, tweaked. I got my shot, uh, my monthly uh, HRT shot and um, I talked to him about my wrist. I've got the paperwork to get my wrist and my hand x-rayed to see what it is that's going on with that. Then, then we went to the doctor to get Harry's uh, precancerous areas looked at, his arms, his hands, all the good stuff, and they did. Here, can you take a picture of this right here? Take off your glasses. Really? Well, because it's in the way right here. They use, they use liquid nitrogen and burn it, mm -hmm. freeze it basically. So they did that. So he's got two beautiful spots right there. Plus he has been given a prescription, which we have to go pick up where you put the cream all over your face. It brings everything to the forefront. He's going to look real crusty for Never a while. Like got beat up. Yeah. And then, um, it pulls all the precancerous and, um, and clears all of that up so he's to the point where he needs to have that done just smear it on but he has to stay out of the sun for that so we have to figure it out so that he does it probably after we get back from mm -hmm. Texas because we're gonna be too far into the sunny time of the year and we're gonna be traveling in our Vita we're gonna be staying at resorts that have the pool so he's gonna have to do it afterwards but he's got that so we did a lot yesterday and it was too late to video and Harry was tired by then. He still was having gastric issues uh, from the very bad of, uh, he said it was probably ischemic colitis, um, pretty bad. And um, so got that taken care of and did all those things, brought Harry home and put him to bed. And he went to sleep for three hours, mm -hmm. three hours yesterday, took a nice long nap and is still tired today, but he's getting better. So you guys, today is bone broth day. Now I've got what's left of, I've got four of my organic uh, chicken bone broth from Kirkland. You buy it by the case there and it's really good. I only have two of these left and two is like one cup for Harry and one cup for me. But this is a really good brand and they have it at Costco. I'm sure Sam's, I've never, we don't have a Sam's. I mean, Harry and I don't have a Sam's club card. Um, the nice thing about Sam's is even if you're not a member, you can order from Sam's club online. You just pay 10% more. Um, on their products because I've done that with emergency food supplies from them before. Um, I like the Dr. Kellyanne. It's very mild, but not when you put your salt, your salty clean slate electrolytes in them, plain electrolytes, no flavor, no flavor ones, or real salt, Organic seasoned salt. If you have a really good organic seasoned salt that you love, that's clean, that you want to use, I would use it. I would even use, you know, barbecue. Here we go. I would use one of these beautiful, delicious tasting ones. Apple pecan smoked salt. Hickory smoked salt. These are all red mineral salt. We have a discount code down in the description below. Chef Blend, which is one of my favorite on meats. I love the cherry blend 
on eggs. It's really, really good. Do you think so, they got those uh, ready for sale because what do you mean the ready? summer's coming for a cooking out? Oh, I'm sure they do. Yeah, I haven't, I, mean, I, I mean, haven't been this week, but I'm sure they do. And then organic pluck. One of our viewers said, are you putting pluck in? It's delicious. So this is the spicy, this is the regular, and then they have the um, organic uh, garlic, which I've completely used up. I like it with my ranch, uh, powdered ranch in my um, faux mashed potatoes with my baked potato soup. But there's lots of ways to flavor these up, you guys, to make them delicious. Now, the ones I like so far are, I like Dr. Kellyanne's, but they're very mild. But what I like about the boxed ones, and I have not tried uh, Ancient Nutrition yet, is you can stick these in your purse. You can stick them in your uh, back of your jeans, in your pocket, and take them with you, right? They all seem to have the same amount of product size packets in. So just note that. Um, Dr. Kellyanne has uh, regular beef. She has got, this one's French onion. She has got rosemary thyme. She's got uh, Thai lemongrass and plain homestyle beef bouillon. Um, the only one I saw for ancient nutrition was the chicken soup. They may have different ones. Um, hers is 70 calories and theirs is 90 calories. It's calories in, calories at, zero fat for her, two grams of fat for them. So the more calories, the uh, more sipping and then drinking that you need to do because we want to stay, um, there are lots of rules out there and rules of thumb when you are fasting. If you're doing a bone uh, broth, fast or a broth fast. You're using it as a lever to have sips to, to keep the cravings at bay, to, to give yourself something to do and not think about the fact that you're not eating for 24 hours or, or, or 36 or, or 24 or even 18, you know, uh, for those of you who are brand new and you're starting to learn how to fast, you, you sip it. It's, it's a tool. It's a lever. It helps satisfy you and keep you satisfied and not as hungry. You're not going to gulp down a whole bowl or a whole huge cup of soup or uh, you are going to have too many calories and it can affect your uh, insulin response and, and like you're really eating. So you're trying to trick your body into thinking it's still fasting but you're able to have a little bit of broth and just sip on it throughout the day. That's basically it. If you have one to two um, um, cups in a day, even three. They, uh, some of the books I've read, including Dr. Kellyanne, she says up to five cups a day. Um, last night, Harry was very hungry at midnight. And I said, let me make you a nice cup of hot broth and we can just sip it before we go to bed. And that was perfect. I was surprised at how much that worked for him because he was so hungry, right? And I said, no, we're on a, we're on a fast. At 7 p.m. is the cutoff from the night before on our entire, um, every single day this month, we're trying to finish eating by 7 p.m. If, if you work swing or graveyard, you know, figure out your shift difference and, and do that. But that way, we've been fasting since 7. Mm -hmm. And tomorrow, when we wake up, it'll be awesome, right? So that's what we are doing. And we started yesterday. So today, it would end at 7 p.m. tonight. He can have another cup of bone broth. Or he can have a piece of toast and some bone broth. I'll give him a piece of toast. I'm, I'm kind. Ah, you guys, we were going to make my um, pound cake recipe with the isopure. I didn't have time. I don't want to do this today. I don't want to trigger anybody who watches this today while you're trying to do a 24-hour fast, including me. They always say, don't go shopping when you're hungry. I, I plan 
for my 24 hour fasts, I'm not gonna go grocery shopping, I'm not gonna go where I can smell tons of delicious food and I'm not gonna cook during this time. I'm gonna have my broth and I'm gonna sip it mindfully. Now, I have containers, I'm gonna share Harry's. We bought these small Stanley stainless steel cups and they just hold they're perfect for this size of careful it's open there's stuff I, in it for broth container thank you dear broth container i heat this up in a pan and pour it in here and then he sips on this all day i'm going to take one with me when i go to get my hair done because my hair is a longer process i'm not getting it um, i'm not getting highlights or low lights or anything put in it i'm just getting my roots done and getting it trimmed because it's getting have you guys noticed how long my hair is getting i mean seriously my hair is getting long now i bought this before i realized harry had issues with curry he cannot have this one because it's thai beef curry but i can so Read the instructions, read the back, make sure the vegetables that are in your bone broth, because they all seem to have some type of vegetable in it, are ones that work well for you and your body. So this would not be for Harry. But I bought it because it's, it's lighter weight. When we're traveling with Arvita, you have to think about weight as well as where am I gonna put it because of cupboard space? So I bought some powdered stuff to try. Now I did um, try the Lano Life uh, product and I liked it. So far I've liked them all. I think the um, mildest, and I think it's because it has the least amount of salt in it uh, and no fat in it are Dr. Kellyanne's, but the minute I put my uh, packet of clean slate salty that I didn't know what to do with because I like I like fruity flavor. I love the flavored ones best. So I'm glad I had all these because that's what I've been using. You said you really liked yours this morning oh, in the yeah. bag. It's because I had one of these in it and then I topped it off with a little um, organic season salt by Red Salt mm -hmm. and it was amazing. And you guys don't have to get the big container. There, where's my little guy? I have a little one. Oh, here it is. For Arvita, I get the regular size ones. I just use this so much that uh, I got the, the bigger one. I love it. So with two of us doing this 24-hour um, fast, I ordered because I made a mistake I said Jim said that this was a good one. He didn't say this was the one, but I really like this one. This is the one we drank today. College Inn Bone Broth. I ordered a case online, and it's College Inn. It's, it sounds more like a hotel motel, doesn't it? Look, Harry, right here. Yep. And this is the beef bone broth. And I always get, if I can, Let's reduced see. sodium because... Then I can add my good salts and I don't have to worry about the bad salts. And Costco delivered, I mean not Costco, Amazon delivered it. Here we go. So, collagen and there were 23,000 views telling me how good that this was one of their best flavored ones on um, when I was reading, I always read reviews, always, always, always. So this one for one cup is 45 calories. There's zero fat in this. Hold please. That might be Felicia. Sorry about that. I was expecting a call. Anyway, uh, the collagen and I got the beef. It's got nine grams of protein per cup. Beef bone broth contains less than 2% of the following yeast extract. So if you can't have yeast, uh, salt, sugar, vegetable stock, concentrates of onion, celery root, carrot, onion powder, garlic powder, sunflower oil, black pepper, celery seed. It does have a total of one gram of sugar. So you do get one gram of carb in this. So you need to read each one because each one goes from zero to one on the carb scale. One, zero to 
two grams of fat. On the fat scale, let me see this one. This one's 0 0.5 fat. This Kirkland brand has um, 0 0.5 grams of fat, zero carbs, zero sugars. It's organic chicken stock, organic vegetable broth, which is, again, organic carrot, celery, and onion. Carrot, celery, and onion are the three main ingredients to soup bases that use beef or chicken or lamb or any of those things. They use those vegetables in almost every single one of them. So you need to read your ingredients. And always, always, always note, homemade is best. Yes, it is, but it's time consuming. It takes room up on my refrigerator and we're gonna be traveling. So I wanted to make sure I had some on hand. And it's easy because Harry doesn't have to cook it or he just grabs one and it works for him. So with less than 2% organic flavor, natural roasted flavor, salt, organic lemon juice, concentrate, organic apple cider vinegar, organic rosemary extract, organic turmeric extract for the color. So mostly they don't have vitamins. The vitamins all say zero. Let me look at this, but this one says it has 53 milligrams or megagrams. It's not ours, is it? Okay, that was the weirdest thing we've ever had happen. Either somebody was trying to get into our truck or the alarm went off mysteriously, went out there. I mean, I hit the truck key to stop the alarm and it stopped. So that is really bizarre because we looked everywhere and we couldn't find anybody. But you guys, I need to get ready to go to go get my hair done. So we'll come back and we'll talk more about bone broth and all things keto. Yes, indeed. But you guys, I'll see you guys in the next segment. When I get my hair done. Yes, indeed. Hey everybody, I am back from the hairdresser. Can you tell? Yes, indeed, I feel fabulous. I got about an inch off and I had a, everything done. It was wonderful. I had a deep conditioner, style, the whole spiel. Takes forever, it does. And it was a late start, so anyway, I feel great. My hair looks good and that's what I'm excited about. And the good news is, is I took my little container of, I took my Stanley, hold on. Took my Stanley with my bone broth. I took another bone broth with me in my purse because they have hot water there and I have a microwave. And I didn't need to do a second one, but I just sipped on my bone broth all day. It was perfect. So anyway, you guys, Basically, we had no food to share. I don't want to cook on the day that I am fasting. I don't want to look at food, don't want to think about food. I just want to concentrate on my intermittent fast day. So, how is everybody doing? Leave me a comment below. How many hours of fast were you able to do today? What did you accomplish? Because it's an accomplishment. You can start with 12 and work your way up. There is no failure in intermittent fasting as long as you have fasted. And every hour more is just one more notch on the belt, right? Type of a thing. Now, how many of you guys are going to hack your health? I want to know who's going so I can be on the lookout for you at Hack Your Health in Austin. I'm super excited. We have to leave um, early the last day, Harry and I do, because we got to hit the road. But other than that, I am super excited to meet everybody. So let me know down in the description below if you're going to hack your health and if it's the first time you've ever done a keto or a ketovore or carnivore or ketogenic sphere of this kind of a conference. Let me know down in the description below. So also, if any of you guys live close to Bosa Chica, Texas, we're going to be down there. Well, Brownsville. Yes, Brownsville. When Harry gets back, he's going to, we're going to be down there. Uh, Harry, Sally and I are going to be down there. And we want to stay down there for 
a week or so, and two, we're going to look at X, the SpaceX. Harry's really interested in doing that, so let us know. We're hoping it's not super buggy and super, super swampy, hot, sultry, and all the good stuff because it's closer to the coast. Yeah, we're closer they're to right the, down there to the equator, yeah, you know. Yeah, to the ocean. Very so. bottom near Mexico. Let us know down in the description below because we want to meet everybody. We want to see you. We're super excited about that. I want to know who's doing our challenge with us and if you did an intermittent fast today and how long it took for you. And tell us which bone broth. Have you guys used any of these? Which bone broth are you finding to be the best one for you and your body? I love the fact that you can get the Kirkland uh, chicken bone broth. And thank you. One of our subscribers said, what about Costco? They carry chicken bone broth. And I thought, oh, you know what? I bought a case of those about six months ago. I went in the cupboard. I've got four of these left. So thank you for the reminder. I've got this new stuff, which is the collagen. And uh, this one's a bone broth in a container. And we're loving doing this. How did you feel today doing an intermittent fast with bone broth? How did you do? So come on, you guys. I am super excited about all of you. Congratulations to all of you who have broken your stall doing our challenge this month, who have lost weight for doing our challenge this month and who feel great doing our challenge this month. Anyway, you guys, we're gonna close out tomorrow. I have to make the uh, pound cake with the different proteins. So stay tuned for that because that is gonna be tomorrow. Yes, it is. Anyway, you guys, please remember to hit the like button, get, subscribe, ring the little bell so you get notified every time we upload a video and give us a thumbs up. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Sally, Sally came to say hi. Hello, everybody. I want some, Mom. Okay, would you like some chicken? Yes. Okay. Uh, yeah. Chicken. Would you like another chicken? Uh-huh. Okay. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night, everybody. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.